See the next problem. Find the complete solution of 1 plus 2xy cos of x square minus 2xy dx plus sin of x square minus x square whole dy is equal to 0. Clearly, we are observing that given differential equation is directly in the form of m dx plus n dy is equal to 0. So, you should write what is m and what is n. First of all, we have to check that whether the given differential equation is exact or not. Okay, we have the condition for exactness which is dou m by dou y is equal to dou m by dou x. If the given differential equation is exact, then only we are able to write the general solution directly. Okay, see. Here what is m? 1 plus 2xy cos of x square. Okay, this is the angle minus 2xy. And uh, what is capital M? Sin of x square. Sin of x square minus x square. So, dou m by dou y is equal to 1 is the constant term. That's why its partial derivative is 0. I don't want to write 0 in the addition, otherwise subtraction. After that, we are taking the partial derivative of m with respect to y. That's why 2x is constant term and cos of x square is also constant term. So, it is enough to write the derivative of y with respect to y only, which is 1. So, it would be 2x into cos of x square, okay, minus here also 2x is constant term, just write the derivative of y with respect to y because whenever we are taking the partial derivative with respect to y, only y, y, y is the variable, okay, particular x is the constant term, okay. So, anyway 2x into 1, 2x and now calculate dou n by dou x. So, here derivative of sin is cos, you should write angle as usually into derivative of x square is 2x minus again derivative of x square is 2x. So, this can be written as 2x into cos of x square minus 2x. Clearly, we are observing that these both are same. So, dou m by dou y is equal to dou m by dou x. Hence, we conclude that given differential equation is exact. So, we can write the general solution now. The required general solution of given differential equation is integration of m dx treating y as constant in the first part. Whenever we are taking the integration with respect to x, obviously y becomes constant plus integral terms of n, integral terms of n not containing x, not containing x whole into dy is equal to c. So, replace the values. Integration of what is m? 1 plus 2xy into cos of x square minus 2xy whole into dx plus integration of terms of n not containing x. Don't forget one important thing. Here don't write all terms of n here. Okay. Just we have to write terms of n which do not containing x. Here n has two terms. This is first term and this is second term. Both the terms contains x. So, do not take anything is equal to c. Okay. It is enough to complete the integration of this first part. Okay. C. Separate the terms first. Integral 1 dx plus here I am observing that y is the constant term. 2 is also constant term but do not write 2 in the outside write cos of x square into 2x in the product 2x into dx minus 2y is the constant term x into dx is equal to c because integral 0 is 0. Now c what is integral 1 dx x plus y into 
by replacing x square is equal to t you will get 2x dx is equal to dt so automatically this part becomes integral cos t what is integration of cos t sin t so directly i will write the integration of this part as sin of x square okay minus 2y into what is integration of x x square by 2 2 2 getting cancelled so you will get only y x square otherwise you can write as x square y as you wish is equal to c this is the general solution of given differential equation okay don't forget it just here i am replacing x square is equal to t so you will get 2x dx is equal to dt so this entire part becomes cos what is x square t what is 2x dx dt so integral cos t is nothing but sin t and what about t again x square so in this way i will get the integration in the next video i will give some more examples on this concept of exact equations thank you very much